makes all the best pancakes in the whole world. Chow down, eat up, and fill out that uniform, little soldier. <laughs> You're gonna make your Uncle Hogwash proud. And always Ooh. remember our motto. The Antarctic core is a cold core, but it's... A lot of fun! Is hot. Our motto is... The Antarctic core is a cold core, but it is a good core, Junior. Hooey, that's a really swell motto, huh? Mm -mm, I gotta write that down. No more pancakes until you have completed your daily duties. Now, do them all, do them well, and do not report back to me until they are done. As you were, soldier. Ooh. Hey, come back here, you! Oh, it's a cute little old penguin thief. Bye-bye, <laughs> penguin. Let's see. The first thing I gotta do is secure the perimeter of the base. Wow, the perimeter goes all around the base. This can make a soldier dizzy. Handles pancake thieves. The guard on duty. Ooh, that's me! Stop! Ah, ah! Mm, soft snow. You get back here with those flapjacks before I tell my uncle. Mm, better not tell uncle. I gotta do is to clean the top secret mosquito bomb launcher. Mm, when I did this in training class, I itched for a month. Step one, remove the mosquito bomb from the launching mechanism. I know right where that is. And put it out of harm's way. Here it'd be good. Perfect. Step two. A good soldier needs to be able to do this operation blindfolded. Mm, I don't remember this part from training school. Now remove the scope. Where's the scope? Here, Scopey Scopey. Sneaky. Aha! You better drop that tall stack. Got him. Uh oh. <laughs> That'll show you who's boss of you around here. Me. Oh, skaters! Get back here, penguin. The Antarctic core is a cold core, but it is the... Uh, uh, I got it here somewhere. Well, it's a cold core, but it is better than a mosquito body in the butt. <laughs> Next thing I gotta do is organize the supply shed. With that sneaky penguin out of the way, this job should be way easy. Okay, that does it. Hmm. Guess I showed that scaredy penguin a thing or two or three about me. Hmm? What's this? From the office of Uncle Hogwash. Pack all pancakes in the mess hall onto a snowmobile. Have Private Chili Willy. Right, that's you. Have him remove them from the base. We have information that an infiltrator may be after him. Hmm, brilliant strategy. That's why my uncle is the Sarge. Nothing gets by him, no sirree. Carry on, Private Chili Willy. 
No! You're not any anarchic core! You are just a stinky little penguin cheater, and I don't like stinky little penguin cheaters! Oh! Stop! Understood. Yes, sir. And why? Because the Antarctic core is a coal core, but it's what? A core with a lot of duties? No, it's a coal core, but it's sometimes warm. No, it's a coal core, but it's a your core, Uncle. Yes. No. Is the Woody World almost ready? Ready, not it! Cowabunga! and their coaches are making fortunes on the pro circuit. There are TV deals, equipment endorsements, and big prizes. Wow! <laughs> Kids, with your time, in my coaching, these babies are going to make us rich and famous. This is great, Uncle Woody. Yeah, a real skateboard park. I called the scout in this article. He's coming to check you guys out, impress him, and we could get a pro skateboarding contract. Did you hear that, Louie? Those wooden heads want to go pro. Well, I've been skating this park for months. If anyone's getting a pro contract around here, it's going to be me. Louie, we got work to do. Okay, first things first. If you want to impress a pro scout, you gotta look like pros. Image is the most important thing. Um, I don't think so. <laughs> and now to make these two hot dogs look like you're skateboarding 100 miles an hour just standing still. Well, you got the hot dog part right. Ketchup and mustard, eh? <laughs> it's Billy and Louie. They're skateboard scum. Well, it's gonna take a lot more than their dumb tricks to stop us. Well, the scout's gonna want to see pro moves like the Freddy Freakout, the Zapata Zigzag, and the Rooster Rail Ride. We can do those, Uncle Woody. Come on, Louie. We'll help you do some moves they'll never forget. Great move! The Freddy Freakout! <laughs> you mean the Marble Meltdown. Out. <laughs> yeah. What a move, Nathead! The Rooster Railroad! Cock-a-doodle-doo! Uh-uh, cock-a-doodle-doo! Ah! 
Woodpecker dude's okay? Uh, yeah, I think so. Hey, go skate the kitty course. Oh, oof. Hey, what's going on? These are the kids you came to see. Yeah, well, I just about designed this course. I deserve any pro contracts that's being handed out. You're nothing but a smelly cheater. And you don't play fair. Hey, the only way for you to settle this is for you to decide for yourself, Chief. Of course, we'd love to race the little wooden heads, but look. They have annihilated and otherwise trashed the entirety of the course, so uh, no racing today. Says who? <laughs> Yay, Uncle Woody! Way to go! How are we going to beat him if we never skated this course before? This is all your fault. So easy. Oh, Billy, I am severely unbalanced. No. Yeah, in the head, you flea dip. Get your grubby paws off me before I. <laughs> this is all your fault, Louis. Put me down. I'd be a pro now if it wasn't. If it wasn't. If it wasn't for you, I'd be. <laughs> Get back here! Totally rad ride. Dids, I want you guys on the circuit. Woohoo! We're going pro? Get some rest, coach. We start training 10 hours a day. First thing in the air. 10 hours a day? That's way too much work. No way! 